family and friends. I am Dr. Holly Martin and I serve as the Vice President for Academic Affairs at St. Charles Community College. It is my pleasure to welcome you to the 2021 St. Charles Community College Commencement Ceremony. Thank you for viewing this most unusual commencement ceremony. Although it is virtual, it remains important to recognize the achievements of our students as they reach this important life milestone. Today you will hear from our college president, board president, faculty representative, and our student speaker. Finally, we will present our candidates for graduation. Again, thank you for tuning in and welcome to the Spring 2021 Commencement Exercises at St. Charles Community College. Hello and welcome everyone to St. Charles Community College's Commencement Ceremony. I'm Dr. Barbara Cavalier, President of St. Charles Community College. As a student, you have gained all the skills and knowledge needed to move to the next level in your educational journey. You have mastered the core competencies of general education. You have improved your writing and computation skills. And no doubt, you have made new friends with whom you will stay in contact with for the rest of your life. You have also connected with many extraordinary faculty members who have introduced you to the world of higher education and inspired you to achieve great things. By the end of this ceremony, you will be college graduates. You will leave this commencement to begin a new chapter in your life. This next chapter will bring new opportunities, new roles, and new expectations. You may experience a few challenges along the way, but please rest assured, we have prepared you well to make a profound difference in the world. You will become the next generation of leaders. You will shape our country's future. We are so proud of all that you have accomplished. Hello graduate, family, friends, colleagues, and all viewing this ceremony today. My name is Dr. Nicole Panair, and I am the Faculty Association President for this school year. I'm also a biology faculty member. Today, it is truly my honor to speak to you. You, the brand new SCC graduates, graduating during these unprecedented times. So first, please let me offer my sincere congratulations. What an exciting and proud moment for you. Today is not about me, but instead it is about amazing you and what you did during a modern pandemic. You are the graduates who showed up and you saw your goals through. You showed up during a really, really hard time when it would have been easy to quit and no one would have blamed you. You continued to show up. And when things completely turned upside down in your academic careers, you stuck it out. I know it wasn't always easy for you. You had to change so much and do it so quickly, and so did we, so I relate completely. You were now learning through your computer, whether you wanted to or not. 
and so much changed. How homework was turned in, how you asked questions of your professors, how you met with classmates, who was around you, and where you were now learning. So let me next take a minute to say that my colleagues and I see you for you and we value you. You all are the faces of perseverance. We had a front row seat to see what you are made of. These unusual circumstances and this pandemic have allowed us to glimpse into what makes you truly you. In my own classes, I have seen students scribbling down notes while simultaneously rocking a baby. I see students moving their cat off their keyboard for the 10th time in a lesson. And by the way, your pets are adorable and should also be seen. I see those students that have just gotten home from working a night shift on a COVID floor, exhausted and weary, only to hop on the Zoom meeting to grind out their day for a few more hours. The perseverance is incredible and admirable. The one thing in common of my students and with all of you, no matter what stage of life you are in, is that you all had a goal and you got one of the biggest things right in going for that goal. You showed up and kept showing up, even when things got hard. So my message today, you keep showing up. You go visualize your highest self and show up for him or her. And you show up again and again. Great things come from showing up. You're living proof of that today. You're also you've also already proven you can stick it out though, through obstacles that none of us could have imagined just over a year ago. I know I can't wait to see what you do in the future. On behalf of the faculty of SCC, please accept my wish for much deserved congratulations. Good morning, graduates. Today we celebrate something unique, a time in our lives we worked hard for, noting that even a pandemic and personal struggles couldn't stop us. No matter how long it took for you to hear your name called today, you are being celebrated and it is well deserved. In our lives, success mostly follows a pattern of knowing, feeling, doing, and becoming. It is the same in our academic endeavors. Our classes take us on a journey of knowing. We learn new skills, ideas, directions, and paths that will help us with our career. We feel. Our passion helps keep our motivation strong. Our excitement leads us onward, eager to push ahead. We do. We put in countless hours each week to study, finish homework, and take tests, all for the goal of becoming what we are today, graduates. For many of us, this isn't the end. You will go on to continue your education as you pursue your academic goals. For some, this is a pause in your education as you uncover where your next steps take you. Life doesn't always move in the direction we expect it. Obstacles come, directions change, families become larger or smaller. My life didn't move in the direction I had planned or expected. I am a widow with two children. I work 11 hours a day and navigate home life, grief counseling for us all, and my college classes. I put my education on pause for a long time, but my determination to reach my goal of graduating with a weather science degree helps to keep me moving forward. No matter the direction your life takes you, obstacles may delay your dreams for a while, but never stop taking the steps that move you closer to your goal. Success involves continually growing in the direction of your dreams. With each step toward it, you move further away from who you once were to become all that you hoped to be. Successful people are passionate about their end game. They're determined to reach their goal and to finish the race. And I can confidently say, everyone graduating today is a successful person. During your time here, you have grown to become not just educated, but more well-rounded, enlightened, you have met people from all walks of life who have inspired you. 
you have made friendships and have learned how to appreciate your ambitions. I hope you take those moments, those lessons with you. Remember how this road, while sometimes challenging, brought you here to the first of many future goals. It brought you success. May this journey of knowing, feeling, and doing lead you to celebrate becoming all that you dream to be. Congratulations, Class of 2021. Good morning. I'm Shirley Lomar, President of the St. Charles Community College Board of Trustees. I'm proud to join you today to present the Distinguished Alumnus Award. Each year, St. Charles Community College honors alumnus that have become leaders in their profession and have positively impacted their community. Because we were not able to hold commencement last year, we are excited to honor both our 2020 and 2021 recipients. Our 2020 distinguished alumnus was Rich Lofridge. With an interest in helping others to make wise financial decisions, Rich Lofridge co-founded Trademark Real Estate, where he has led by example as the top sales agent since the company's inception in 2011. As the company grew, they purchased and renovated an office space on Main Street in St. Peter's and in 2015 merged with Realty One Group. When Rich was first getting started with his education, it was a theater scholarship that brought him to SCC. At the time, he didn't know exactly what he wanted to do, and it was up to him to pay for his own education. Rich received an associate degree from SCC and a bachelor's degree in business administration from Lindenwood University while working full time. As business grows, his love of theater and his community college remain. He is on the board of directors for Act Two Theater in St. Peter's and serves on the SCC Alumni Council. He has performed in more than 15 SCC center stage theater productions while a student and as an alum. Congratulations, Rich. And this year, our 2021 Distinguished Alumni is Seth Pyman. As the administrator for NHC National Healthcare Corporation, St. Charles, Seth Pyman is proud of his caring team and how dedicated they are in caring for their patients. This past year has tested the medical community and those who care for others in ways never imagined. Before beginning his career, Seth took a class at St. Charles Community College. That helped him identify careers that aligned to his talents and interests. He knew becoming a doctor like his two older brothers was not the path for him and was determined to find a career that he found fulfilling and of service to others. SCC's teaching and learning environment was what he needed at the time and assisted him in completing a bachelor's degree at the University of Missouri Columbia. He credits the teachers at SCC for instilling the confidence he needed to go on to get his degree and then find meaningful work. Seth believes in giving back to his community. For the last 12 years, he has served on the board of the St. Charles Community College Foundation, a cause he deeply believes in. The mission to support students with scholarships and academic enhancements, especially nursing students, is close to him. Seth sees firsthand every day at work the important role educated nurses have in the senior care environment. He said the connections he has made during his service for SCC Foundation have been invaluable to him and his coworkers. Seth said he strives to be a resource for others and as they begin or complete their education journey. Congratulations, Seth. And congratulations to all of our graduates today. At this time, we will proceed with the presentation of candidates for the Associate of Arts, Associate of Fine Arts, Associate of Arts in Teaching, Associate of Science, 
and Associate of Applied Science degrees, as well as the Certificates of Achievement and Certificates of Specialization.
Madam President, I proudly present to you the St. Charles Community College Class of 2021. Graduates, you have completed all the requirements for your associate degree or certificate. On the recommendation of Faculty and Administration of St. Charles Community College, and by virtue of the authority vested in me through the Board of Trustees and the Missouri Department of Higher Education, I hereby confer upon you your respective degree of Associate of Arts, Associate of Fine Arts, Associate of Arts in Teaching, Associate of Science, Associate of Applied Science, Certificate of Achievement, and Certificate of Specialization with all the rights, privileges, and honors appertaining thereunto. Congratulations, Class of 2021. On behalf of all the faculty and staff at St. Charles Community College, congratulations, graduates. We are excited for the futures that await you, and we wish you all the best.